Hello everyone, welcome to Tech Support Error Unknown, released February 27th, 2019, developed by Dragon Slumber, published by Iceberg Interactive. Things are not what they seem at your new tech support specialist job. While resolving customer issues, you find yourself in the middle of a conspiracy. Will you side with your employer, join a rogue hacktivist group bent on destroying them, assist the police, or stand alone? Swearing? Oh. My virgin ears. Uh, yes. Uh, we gotta turn the music off. Thank you. Oh, wait, hold on. What else did we have? Uh, blah, blah, blah. Uh huh. Yes. Uh, okay, we'll, we'll stick. Actually, let's make this bigger so that everyone else can see it. Oh, okay. Small is. Small is already very big. Create a new profile. Um. Uh, yes, incognito. What's this? Oh, okay. Uh, enter your first name. <clears throat> Let's see. Uh, yes, uh, my name is Lars Ulrich. Do not sue me. Uh, male gender. D date of birth. This really seems relevant but there is only one birthday and that is january the first uh intern experienced professional well experienced appears to be the default so we will go with that. oh uh shit that's my username i hope i don't have to remember that that's a lot to type in login quasar click here and check your emails first Oatmeal. Welcome, newest employee of Quasar. Lars, already do not sue me. On behalf of Quasar Telecommunications, I am happy to welcome you to our family. You are part of our exciting new program, which allows our technical support specialists to work directly from home. Imagine. This is released in 2019. The future truly is here. Your new Spectrum system will connect you directly with our customers through the help desk ticketing system. Once you feel ready, simply respond to this email and I will remotely unlock the support desk to get you started because you use a private proprietary system. We expect you to remain within the city limits of your Spectrum device for all security reasons. Your OS is a state of art and you can expect to see its potential grow over time. Finally, please note that your Spectrum system remains the property of Quasar and as such, we expect you to take care of it to ensure quality work. We may monitor your activities, including interactions with customers, emails, and any other activity we deem necessary. You are being watched. Welcome to the team. We know you will be a terrific addition to the Quasar family. Best regards, Kamala at Quasar Tech Support Director Reply. Thank you for your warm welcome. I'm ready to start providing the very best in tech support for Quasar customers. Have a nice day, Lars at Quasar. Send. Uh, okay. To all tech support specialists, I'm happy to announce that following your multiple requests, we have finally established an official Quasar wiki containing information about how to deal with common issues raised by customers. You will find the link to the wiki available directly in NetTraveler. We encourage you to all dive in and refresh your memory as needed. Quasar is grateful to have you all contribute to make this tech support team number one worldwide. Hello again, you'll find text, uh, you'll find support desk as a file attachment to the... As a file attachment... Simply click on the file name at the top to install the software. Once you run the application, I'll be your first customer to ease you into the process as soon as you're ready. Oh, and please call me Kamamala. Thank you, Kamamala. New file downloaded. Hello, my name is Lars. What can I do for you? Hi, Lars. I hope you're settled in and ready to solve some problems. Well, I tend to create them more than solve them, but I'll do my best. I couldn't find a record of your previous employment. Do you need any help with the support desk system? You can answer using the yes or no options in the chat menu. Click for chat options. Um, do you need any help? Yeah. Uh, well, I don't have any idea what I'm doing, so yes. Yes, I would like that. All right, let's do a quick demonstration with Tutorial, then. Just be natural and answer as quickly and precisely as you can. Oh, Jesus. Give me a second here. I didn't get a chance to read that. I'll put this together. I'll get tutorial. Oh, good luck. Okay, good. Ah, uh, and there we go. Hello, and welcome to Quasar. My name is Lars. Can I resize these? Oh, good, because this is just not enough. It's going by too fast. <clears throat> 
Hello, Lars. I would like some help with my mobile phone. Can he provide assistance? Yes. You're at the right place. Rest assured. Hooray. Let's get started. Uh. Okay. What is the problem you're encountering? I'm unable to find my phone. Oh, no. Uh, 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 uh. If you call yourself, you'll be able to hear the ringtone if it's nearby. Ooh, that's a good suggestion. I'll try it out right now. <laughs> I found it, thank you. But now I have another problem. Can you help me? Mr. Blank. Seems to be the problem. I can't connect to the internet. Oh, no. Oh, the solution. Um, um, procedures. Change the screen. Service escalate issues. Smart talk talk. Fetch up. Procedures. Uh, have you tried a um, uh, uh, did you try reboot the phone? Have you tried turning it off and on again? No, I don't think that it would work. Remember that you can look at the wiki for the, the wiki, the wiki, wiki, net traveler, uh, oh, quasar wiki, um, a solutions. Uh, 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 restarting the phone. I already tried that one. Uh, uh, changing. Okay. Uh, um, if uh, well, that's an awful drastic. Yeah, I was going to say that's a drastic suggestion there. Um, oh, settings. There it is. Have you tried changing options in the settings menu? Oh, that's usually a good idea, but I don't think there's any good solutions for these. I don't want to escalate. I think my solution is just fine. Don't question me, Owl. I know more than you. Okay. <clears throat> I know it's a tall ask, but don't worry. I'll be watching to make sure everything works fine. And remember that you can use the new ticket button to accelerate your process. Best of luck. I'm sure you'll do great. Thank you. Alrighty then. Ah, a new ticket assigned. Boy, they are wasting no time. And I have to resize it every fucking time. Hi there. My phone hasn't worked right since yesterday. What happened? I don't remember anything special happening. Okay. Then... <clears throat> Have you tried turning it off and on again? Oh, all right then. Uh, well, then in that case, have you attempted a factory reset? Okay. Um. What exactly is the problem? You said it's not working right. Oh, well, then, just fuck me. It's a screen tip shit. <sighs> wow. Very difficult. Very difficult customer. Hold on. Uh, to confirm your registration, simply reply to this email. We and Hawkins and Lee are proud to help our customers find the best points of land and real estate to match their... I didn't sign up for shit. You've reached Lars. Okay. What's your problem, chappy? Um, what happened? Ah, well then, in that case, how about we dry that phone out? 
Oh, okay then. <clears throat> um. Try changing the battery. Well, no, you need to dry it out. Okay. Um. Well, then it seems as if this is another one where we can't really help you, buddy. Uh, let's see. Phone mishandling. Uh, broke screens. Lost phones. Okay, well, then, you know. Should the problem be impossible to resolve with the tools available to you, they may escalate your changes. Your social list should be used as a last resort when all those solutions failed. Well, I feel like that's where we're at, because, uh... And I've got no other... What? <sighs> five stars, and I didn't actually do anything. Uh, why does your star rating only go to five? Lots just so much more price. They're phenomenal. It's hard to believe in this day and age that they're still uneducated, unpolished, and intelligent use like Lars out there. Well, it's true. I am real. As hard as it is to believe. Here we go again, day two. Don't forget to check your emails every day. About the warranties. Congratulations on a successful first day. We'll make a brilliant specialist out of you. Yet, looking at your tickets, I realize we installed the wrong version of support desk, which didn't include the warranty options. I've taken the liberty of updating it remotely. You should be good to go. Here's some basic information about the two types of warranties our customers can access. Extended warranties cover every issue a customer may encounter if you are unable to troubleshoot a problem that should always be escalated. Standard warranties only cover technical issues and not problems caused by the customers themselves. Therefore, cracked screens and or lost phones should never be escalated. Instead, simply reply that you cannot help them. Problems occurring from natural use, such as batteries charging slowly, are not covered under any warranty. Of course, customers with no warranty should never be escalated. However, you are still expected to go on and offer them Tier 1 expertise. After all, we are in the business of keeping our customers satisfied. I know you will continue to impress the company with your achievements. Thank you for your support, Kamala. I appreciate it. <clears throat> oh, okay, I finally broke down a call to tech support. You better be worth it. Well, you are already starting from a position of pleasantry, and so you shall be treated accordingly. Oh, I see, I see. Well, what happened? Hmm. All right, then. You may need to change that battery. It sounds like it's worn down. All right, then. Here we have January 6th perpetrator, Keith Tellman. Why, hello, young man. Here you can uh, help me with my cellular telephone. Uh, yes, yeah, so it seems to be the problem. Mm, are you okay, Keith? Are you experiencing... <laughs> a senior moment. Not a problem. Not a problem, gentlemen. <laughs> Interesting. And another. Megan Flowers. Yo, I have a problem. Well, I have a solution, though. Probably. My phone doesn't work probably. Okay, well, can you give me some little bit more information than that? What happened? Let's see. Now, well, can I get a little bit of it? What exactly is problem? Ah, uh, Megan. Megan, Megan. Okay. What exactly is the issue? We don't know. And so, instead, I will just simply suggest you try changing the settings in your phone. You haven't even explained your problem. I don't know what's wrong. What happened? Okay. 
You may need to reboot your phone. Oh, well, of course you have. Why wouldn't I have guessed that from the zero information that you provided me? Have you tried changing your battery? Okay. <laughs> have you tried a factory reset? Thank you. Great. Terrific. Wonderful. Wonderful. Megan has a very peculiar school of thought on assistance and how it works. Ah, hola. My name is Francis. I hope you can help me with my problem. What is your problem, Francis Brennan? If that is your real name. Tapping the screen, but nothing is happening. Oh. Well. What happened? I have to, I don't know, should I? Okay, try rebooting your phone. Okay, then. Try replacing the screen. Okay. Then a factory reset. Well, luckily for you, I have these procedures. You're welcome, Francis. Very welcome. Man, everyone was fairly... Even Megan. Even Megan, who had no idea how to even ask for help. That's what we like to see. <clears throat> Click the timer to pause the game. Oh, well. Flying toasters, I remember those. We're all the way back to 1993. Excellent. All right. Out mail. Nothing new. Support desk. Hello, Anyball. What seems to be the problem? Oh, dear. Well, you're going to need to replace that screen. Okay. Wonderful to hear from you. Colt T. Oh my goodness. Is it my brother? It is. What seems to be the problem? <laughs> uh. You can't ignore the reality anymore. I've been taking care of her as much as I can, but costs have been piling up. Since my job cut some of my hours, it's been difficult to afford her medication. I missed a dose two weeks ago. She immediately got worse. We need money bad, but if you can send me $150 today, I'll be able to buy her the pills she needs. Please, can you help? I really need this fast. I don't believe you're really my brother. I have no knowledge of a mother nor a brother. What happened? Okay. His mother under warranty. <laughs> what? <laughs> Have you tried turning her off and on again? <laughs> okay. Yes. Me too. A solution? None of my available solutions have anything to do with any of this. Um, have you tried drying her off? 
Um, okay, I don't have time to you know, spend some basically the tech guy for the tech guys. Okay, fantastic. Um, have you tried changing her battery? Yes, I'm enjoying my time trying to maintain two conversations. Um, procedures. Um, call yourself. This is, a, this is intentionally dividing my attention. Okay, fine. Yes. Okay. I mean, the only uh, the only one that we really have is uh, to can't help, but that hardly seems like uh, the right thing to do here. Okay. Um, well, I mean, escalation is wrong. What am I going to do? Pawn him off on somebody else? Um, how to factory reset. Mm hmm. Fine. Okay, fine. I have a very limited available um, options here, so. Okay, yes. <clears throat> You're welcome. Truly, the world is a better place with me in it. Good God, what, are, what do you want from me? I can't help. Okay, wonderful. All right, understood. If I found my kind of, you can send the hundred. I kind of remember it's urgent. Mom is in pain. Here. We need to take care of her now. Am I supposed to be able to do this? Is this a thing that I can do? Oh, it seems I can. Uh, uh, I have been earning monies. I do not have 150. I have 104. So, we must keep working. Back to the salt mines. It's the only way to save Mother. Hello, Jonathan Perk. John, yes, that's how you spell it. Jonathan Perez. Well, that's how they spell it anyway. Uh, what is your problem? I have a solution for every problem. Oh, I see, I see. Well, have you tried checking your phone's settings? Any day now, Jonathan. Time is money. Excellent. Yes, you're welcome. Jennifer Ball, I believe I was speaking to your sister Annie just the other day. What is your problem, dear? Distorted image on the screen. Jesus Christ. What happened? Don't have one hundred and fifty. Okay. Um, have you tried rebooting the phone? <clears throat> I 
can't reply. Oh, there it is. There. I guess I'll just tell them to fuck off. Oh, of course they do, yes. It didn't work. Oh, okay then. Try replacing the screen then. Hmm. Oh, they're going to monitor me. Oh, for God's sake, factory reset. Fine. Oraganel. No, I'm busy. I'm working. I did, Indigo Fox. No, I don't. I'm trying to earn money to save my mother. No, I don't know what you're talking about. They seem perfectly fine from what I've seen so far. But I also don't know anything about them. They're a corporation. They've got money. They've got government contacts. What are you talking about? Remove your tinfoil hat, sir. Tempt the devil. They're a telecommunications company, and I haven't seen anything at all nefarious. Check out. How much money do I have now? Almost. Almost there. One more day. Carolyn DeVito. I'm a big fan of your father's. Um, what is your problem? Ah, well, you go into your phone settings to do something like that. Naturally. Oh, well, glad I could be of service. Nicholas Clay. I hack what problem. Well, what is your problem, sir? Not getting any sound. Oh, well, have you checked your settings? Well, excellent. Two up and two down. What else will we face today? Robbed Malone. Yes, Mr. Malone. That is your real name. What is your problem? You forgot the password to your phone. Well, you must factory reset that phone, then. That's quite simple, you see. What? What in the hell? Well, that's quite unexpected. Tintagel Corporation. Look at that. A hearty 2K of memory. Or was that two megs? I didn't see. I'm back in. Did I receive my pay for the day? Indeed, I have. A transfer. What? Spence. Oh, 
Spence? Who the fuck is Spence? Oh, for God's sake. I would like to send you the money, but unfortunately they won't let me. I don't know who Spence is. Uh, oh, come on. I didn't get a chance to see what the thing is. Uh, it is two megs. I take it Spence is some <sighs> two one oh seven four oh and four shadows one or your company idea the recent emails are assuming you got trouble is at least dangerous but I don't know if you dick got you, like, you have done this on purpose. You have done this on purpose. Two one oh seven four oh Okay. I'm happy to announce your probation is... Uh, what? Oh, come on. Because I didn't open my email fast enough to get the code. I see. Oh, that's definitely a bad ending, isn't it? Possibly the worst. Ah, Kamala, I have to admit I'm quite disappointed in you as well. I thought we were a family. You said we were a family in orientation. You don't terminate your family. All right. Well, that's clearly a bad ending, but, you know, to be expected, at least for myself. Ending 20, there are more than... There are at least 20 endings to this. Or is that, like, ending two of... I don't know. Didn't make it very long, but that's fine. I'm just getting the hang of the, the game anyway. Let's see how we do in a part two, eh? What do you say? This uh, is clearly not a um, <clears throat> a learning game, an educational game, and that's fine. It doesn't actually build itself as one. It doesn't build itself as a hacking simulator either. It's a uh, hacking-themed puzzle adventure game. So I do want to at least play with it until we get a little bit more of that intrigue, at least one more part, because I'd prefer to not end on, a, on getting fired. It won't go out like that. So see you on part two.